guys, and what is up? It's your girl Julia back with another video. Today's video is going to be a makeup tutorial on this look. It is inspired by the Dolan Twins look that they did in 2016, and so I recreated it and added my own twist by making some skin slabs and, you know, adding glam, of course. But yes, you guys, I really hope you enjoy this video, and let's do that thing. You. First thing, I'm going to be covering the front of my eyebrows in Vaseline because I'm not risking any of my hair getting pulled out by latex. Okay, so I'm going to be doing Grayson's makeup. He had his left side covered. So taking just a gray eyeshadow, I'm going to draw that line. So what I'm thinking what I want to do is I want there to be like skin flaps right here because it's like your... <clears throat> because it's like your face and then like into the skeleton so I want it to be like you're like peeling off of it or like something I don't I'm like really scared to use a brush and latex because I know it ruins them so like bye around me are familiar. my eyebrows are very close together and that's why I fear getting latex on them because latex is definitely getting, gonna get on with this so what I think is I'm gonna do tissue on like these parts but then on this I'm just going to do latex and then I'll like try to just peel it up and see if it like looks like skin. Hopefully it does because if it doesn't. There's a little too much right here by my nose so I'm going to take some off. Excuse me. Honestly, special effects makeup is just the best because it's crazy what you can turn yourself into. It really is. It's gnarly, dude. I think I might need to do another layer of paper. Sure, let's do it. Putting more latex on so I can put more paper on. Sometimes I kind of hate the toilet paper because it gets that texture. Okay, the latex is mostly dried, so I'm gonna go ahead and peel up this side. Oh wait, I have to cover in foundation first, haha, <laughs> oops, forgot. Take a foundation that is either your shade or a little bit darker. You never want to go for anything lighter. That did nothing. <laughs> I got concealer for all the lighter spots that I needed. Now I'm gonna set all of it. Oh my god, it's ripping out my hair. Kind of backfired there's nothing to peel what i think i was supposed to put more layers of the just the latex on and it probably would have worked so i think i'm gonna go back down the middle and apply a little bit of tissue with the latex hopefully it'll work i literally put all my latex away literally just stay i'm actually really happy because this dried and i peeled it up and now I'm going to be taking more foundation and just the whole this side of my face. Literally, why didn't I go get my beauty blender? This is like the grossest sponge I've ever touched in my life. Make sure you set the skin flaps hella because you don't want them to be shiny. Who has shiny skin flaps? Not I, said the fly. Okay, Julia, bye. Time to finally get started on this skeleton. Okay, so I have really big eyebrows. So... My eye socket is going to be pretty freaking big, but it's fine. A black cream paint and this little eyeliner brush. It's not a perfect circle. In the picture, Grayson has a lot more space in between his eyes, but you know, I'm telling you, my eyebrows are just a little out there. Taking a bigger brush with the cream paint. Literally, my eye is huge because my eyebrow. Okay, now I'm going to do the whole part on this side. The front of this, don't fill in all the way because you actually do some teeth right there, so... Okay, time for the white. Not even gonna lie, this cream paint like sucks. So maybe get a good cream paint and then you'll be good. But... 
Don't know what I just did. Okay, so I got the white everywhere. It's just the texture is pretty bad. So I'm gonna go in with the sponge. Hopefully fix the texture. Looks like this is the best texture I'm gonna get. It's still not the greatest. I'm gonna go ahead and sharpen all these edges again with the black. Okay, now for the eye, I'm gonna be setting the whole thing with black eyeshadow. Setting my nose as well. I need to look at their teeth again. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm shaking so much, I'm so hungry. Taking a wipe. I'm just going to wipe away some of this. With these teeth, don't worry about them being even. Once you have like the base of all the teeth, I'm going to be taking a gray shadow and kind of just... Now going in with the liquid eyeliner, I'm just going to be defining a few of the teeth. Going in with eyeliner to darken the eyes as much as I can. Doing the cracks. The skeleton side is officially done, but now we gotta move on to the glam side. Okay, so with this little elf palette, I'm gonna take these two shades and put them in my crease. Taking these two, I'm gonna use those to darken it just a little more. Transferring it to the bottom lashes. Just did some fake lashes, and now I'm going to be taking blood and putting it just right along the line. Don't forget to cover your skin flaps in it, too. This is a thick blood. So, yes, you guys, that is the tutorial. I really hope you enjoyed it. I really hope you use it. I really hope it was helpful. I really hope that you share your recreations with me. If you do decide to do this look, please tag me on my social medias. They will be in the description. It was really fun. It took a really long time, and I'm literally shaking because I'm so hungry. So I'm going to go eat. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe while you're at it. And like I said before, follow me on my social medias. Tag me in your recreations if you decide to recreate it. I really hope you do. You know, And I will see you in my next video. Peace!